I've only been a bassist in two bands. They do happen to be two seminal punk rock bands in Los Angeles. I was the bassist for a band called The Weirdos for a number of years, um, which is one of the first, pretty much the first right there with the germs documented punk rock bands in Los Angeles. And uh, another band that you may know of, a um, little band called The Circle Jerks. When I picked up my first guitar and able to make my own decisions, my first guy was Bob Dylan and Neil Young and some of the great flat pickers like Doc Watson, Leonard Cohen, and people that could make a song go directly to the listener with just a single guitar, a lyric, and a melody. My first album that I learned was um, Bob Dylan's Nashville Skyline Rag. And uh, from there, I, I gobbled up every piece of music. It's a great honor for me. This is actually my first festival uh, booking as a solo artist. And so I am quite, quite honored and excited to be a part of Beach Life. Before I leave this world, well, I hope you find a song that loves you for all time And that song saves your life What I did was, when they said, would you want to play in a funk band, I was like, yes. I said, yes. And they said, well, would you like to act in a movie called Repo Man? I said, yes. <laughs> Feeling seven up, I'm feeling seven up. Feeling seven up, I'm feeling seven up. It's a crisp, refreshing feeling, crystal clear and... I'm Xander Schloss, and I uh, invite you to the Beach Life Festival down in Redondo Beach to see me um, and some of my friends play the speakeasy stage. Uh, People like Jim Lindbergh from Pennywise and Johnny Two Bags from Social Distortion and myself from a little band called The Circle Jerks. There's a song in my heart makes my love for you shine.